everyone, it's Jack Bowie here and I'm here with an unannounced uh, quick little Facebook Live on ChatGPT because I know that this piece of software is going absolutely nuts and um, I know I'm using it every single day in my business and I just know that um, it's something that I think that I want to share with you guys instantly because I think it's something that you can implement in your businesses immediately and absolutely take advantage of this. Um, currently this software is free, um, however I have heard that it, because it's going absolutely gangbusters it is going to be um, paid soon so I think get in there start using it get your head around it um, and then you can work out you know later on if there's some sort of investment well great you, you know the power of it and what it's worth to you anyway I'll get started so chat GPT is an artificial intelligence AI tool that does I don't even know how to describe how many things I'm gonna say I'm using it for my copywriting but I know that it can be used for whole range of other things. So I'm just going to show you a couple of things that I use it for that I know you guys would love. Um, so let's kick it off. All right. So say, for example, I wake up this morning in Australia and I think I want to do a blog for the Winning Academy, but I have no idea what to do a blog about. So maybe I'll just start thinking about the different vendors that are at a wedding and maybe I want to mix it up. And today I want to write about a caterer. And I'll say to, I just go in here, down the bottom here into the chat box. Um, otherwise, I can press new chat up here and it will start one for me. And I'm just going to say, I'm very polite to my chat, cheap GPT. I say, please, please, can you write me an SEO friendly blog about the latest trends in wedding catering? Or I'm going to be really specific. Oh, I forgot to say how many words. But let's, let's just see what happens. I literally just sit and my good little friend writes my blog for me. Ah! And the content is really, really good. Right? So we'll just sit here for a minute and watch what it comes up with. So if I go quiet while this is happening, I'm just wanting to check if anybody's writing questions to me or anything because I can't see it on my screen. So I'm going to check my phone. Okay, it doesn't look like there's anyone there yet. Good. If you do have any questions, please just pop them um, as comments and I can see them on my phone. Okay, so there you go. Copy and paste. Literally, there's my blog title. There's my intro. There's my content. Now I could go back and I'll say this is great uh, but can you make this longer at 1000 words? It literally is going to rewrite the whole thing and make it a thousand words. I love, can I just tell you, I love this software. It is just incredible. Um, okay, I'm going to stop there with that one. What's another thing that you can do? Okay, let's have a look at, um, I can't, you can't see what I'm doing, but I'm going to go to, in the background here, the Wedding Academy store, and I'm going to find a product in my store. So I've just picked the certificate in floral design and I'm going to say to chat, I can't even say this, chat GPT. I'm going to say to it, um, can you please write me a 600 word SEO friendly product description for this product, which in capitals is called certificate in floral design design. Now, if you have something to attach like um, a link or I'll show you in a sec, other text, you, you need to put, what's that? What's that? Semicolon? I don't know what that is. That thing there. 
and then go like that. So with this one, I'm sharing the link to the product and it's now writing me a 600 word SEO friendly product description. Other things that I've used this for, even in my personal life in the last week, um, I was selling my house and now I am putting it as an Airbnb listing. So I shared the sale listing of my house and I said, can you please rewrite this description as an Airbnb listing? And it did. Um, I've had it redo my LinkedIn profile. Um, I found that the way that I wrote about all of my jobs was slightly different. Sometimes it was in first person, sometimes it, it wasn't. Um, so I one by one copied them in and I said, can you please rewrite these in first person? Um, and it redid my entire LinkedIn profile. Um, now, wow, there's a really great product description there for certificate in floral design. Um, other things that can do, God, there are just so many. Um, okay, so we've done what a product, we've done um, a blog. Um, you can even go to get ideas like um, what are some further. So this is this is not asking it to write. This is asking it to like think for us, right? So what are some further revenue ideas for our wedding planning? business darling don't panic and then there's that little thing I'm gonna get it to look at the website to read that to get more info and background I'm gonna say I'm gonna be even more specific what are 50 revenue ideas for our wedding planning business darling don't panic go This one, this one's a little bit generic, so I might need to refine that. I'm going to stop it and I'm going to just reword that. Or I might even stop here and just go, can you make that more specific to this business? See if that works. Ha. Huh. It's pretty cool. We do most of them anyway, so I might stop it there and say, what about additional revenue streams that are not planning? Aha, uh -huh. rentals of event equipment, sales of wedding favors and gifts. Yep. Wedding for top. Yep. Awesome. So it's kind of like the more detail you give it, the better um, the results going to be that comes out. So I guess, I guess what I'm trying to say is um, this is a fantastic tool for, um, you know, for me, copywriting holds me up all the time. Um, I've got to write copy for a pin. I've, Jane's got, Jane does her own for Instagram, but um, I've got to write it for TikTok. I've got to write a blog. I've got to write um, product for a template. I've got to write, um, you know, all, all of these things, um, descriptions on a course or, um, you know, all of these things I can actually pump into here and get excellent, like an excellent response. Um, anyway, I'd love to um, hear what else you guys are using it for. I'm sure there's a whole stack of you out there that are playing with this. So what haven't we thought of? Let's share these ideas with each other and see if we can help each other absolutely use this tool to really grow our wedding businesses. Have a good day.